Green Summoners, Invader Sav here. Welcome to another episode of League of Legends Point of View. Today, I will be playing a normal draft game as mid lane Cassiopeia. As always, my runes and masteries will be in the description of this video. Our team comp consists of Ash and Gangplank bot. Yes, this is support Gangplank. We also got ourselves Fiora top. A jungle Maokai and myself as, as mid lane Cassiopeia. And our enemies are Misfortune and Nunu Bot. We also got Rise Mid, which will be my opponent, Listen Top. And we also got Skarnel Jungle. Skarner. Jungle, I mean. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Now, speaking a little bit about uh, Cassiopeia, she is a champion. Oh, of she's course. actually an AP carry. She specializes in having a great amount of sustain damage and burst damage as well. So she's a very balanced champion. She also has great crowd control abilities. So overall, she she's just a very well well-rounded champion. And she actually has she's kind of on, on the OP side of things, in my opinion. Now, uh, depending on how you play her, you actually can do very well or quite horribly wrong and hopefully this game I'll do fine. Now she is pretty strong against Rice, so hopefully this is gonna be an easier lane for me. There we go. So okay, so your passive allows you to um, have reduced mana consumption on your abilities as long as you keep uh, casting in su succession and every time you get a successful cast you gain 10% reduction on the mana costs of your abilities so that's actually quite powerful and uh, in the lane you really want to, to be spamming your skills as much as possible so you can have that passive going and I, will, I won't start being extremely aggressive until I get at least like level 2 or 3 so I can ha get um, 2 points into my Q actually at level 3 so it actually hurts a lot more but as you can see Rice is very afraid of me because he does know that I can do a lot of damage to him as us he can do as much a lot of damage to me as well but eventually I will be able to outclass him especially right now look at this there we go he's dead that's what I'm talking about as level a uh, level 3 year it's when you're the most uh, the most powerful and you should uh, abuse that as soon as you hit level 3 and coupled with your ignite it's almost a guaranteed kill every time especially against champions such as Ryze which need a little bit more time to get their damage up now uh, I will be taking their enemy rates hopefully they're up let's see here they're not so I'll just continue farming here now item wise you have a lot of ways that you can build her and getting too early Doran's rings is actually a, a very powerful thing you can do on her especially right now which will allow me to have dominance over the rice especially hitting those awesome some cues okay now let me talk about her abilities which, because I'm just getting sidetracked here getting that first blood so her Q as you can see there it's a spammable skill it does damage in an AoE after a short duration and it actually poisons, poisons the enemy. Now, the poison is an extremely important part of her kit because it does allow you to have a consistent form of damage which is your sustained damage for calling it some uh, your damage over time spells. And as you saw there, even though it's damage over time, it, it actually allows you to do a great amount of burst and being able to land your your cues is the most important part of about playing Cassiopeia. So the great thing about it though is that once you land a poison on your enemy, you're able to synergize with another one of your abilities, your E, which I'll talk about in a little bit. But you saw me there use the combo. When you land your Q, you're able to throw your your E at, at the enemy multiple times and it actually uh, has an extremely reduced cost in and, and it reduces mana cost and, and cooldown, especially if you are spamming it because of your passive and also because it has very low cooldowns on a target which is poisoned. And and that's pretty much it. Now, uh, the other thing about your Q is that if you manage to land it on an enemy champion, you actually 
yes, you actually gain movement speed, which is also a very important part of her ability kit, having that additional movement speed to me. when she lands that Q, because it does allow her to stick to targets like you like you see right now, like, like you saw that early on. Okay, now after that, you got your W. Now your W is a uh, an AOE damage you place on the ground, and it actually is very important for your kit as well as it is a slow and it applies poison, which does allow you to use your your other abilities a couple of times as well. You're spamming your your E. There we go. I really want to go back, but I'm I'm doing such a good. <laughs> Good job here farming. I'll just wait a little bit longer. Cassiopeia can actually stay in the lane a very long time because of her passive. And make me a. Tell me everything. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that that's pretty much it for your uh, for your E. Now your E does allow you to place uh, to keep poisoning your target as many times oh, as they pass okay. over the the poison. Which is very powerful, uh, especially in a team fight or a small skirmishes where you place it down in the middle of the of the enemies, and they just they just don't. Um, it's not something they're they're looking to evade more than anything. That's what I'm t trying to tell you here. It's something that it's there, and they don't see it sometimes, and you just keep applying your damage. So it's it's great to have. Gonna head back quickly here. Let's see what he bought. He's buying defensive items. I'm gonna go right into the sorcerer's shoes. The movement speed is going to be extremely important against him and I'm going for my early dominance build as, as I usually do with, when playing her. You could have gone for a Rod of Ages but what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go straight into AP after these these two Doran's rings. I'm going to buy the death cap. So my next buy hopefully will give me that. Now <laughs> right now I'm, I'm extremely sure I can kill the rice and that's because of your ultimate. I'll talk about it in a little bit. So your E quickly is the spammable skill. You are able to... Oh, they're gonna try and steal my stuff here. Let's see if... Uh, that's fine. You're dead, boy. Oh, he just stole the red. I mean the blue, huh? You bastard. You gotta pay for that. I have a lot of damage, so I can probably kill him. Thank you. That's what I'm talking about. You're just extremely powerful, like you can see there. You have so much burst, and at the same time, so so much uh, so much damage over time as well. You saw me there spamming my my E on on my enemies. It does a significant amount of damage. It's like basically having an additional. That's a bad idea, boy. <laughs> Had to flash that out of that, but that's fine. Oh, oh, he's gonna flash. He's gonna flash. I'm dead. Damn it! I saw that coming. No! Dumbass. I should have gone back. I got way too greedy there. Don't worry, I'll get my blue buff back. You'll see. You'll see. Okay, so yeah, that's pretty much your E, spammable when you're targeting someone who's poisoned. And then you got your ultimate, your ultimate is extremely powerful, especially in a team fight, but it's also very powerful in one-on-one -on -one situations. It is a stun for two seconds if you're able to, able to hit an enemy who is facing you, and it's a very strong slow if they're not facing you, if they're walking away. But still, very powerful nonetheless, since you it will apply the damage either way. And especially if you land your stun, it's a perfect time for you to place your W and then place your Q on the target and just start spamming your E. If you're quick about it, oh they didn't steal the, the blue actually. If you're quick about it you should be able to do the full combo in about one second or even less and then you start spamming your your E many many times. There we go. You're no fun. I'm gonna place down never mind, we're fine. We have a ward on the on the intersection area there. So yeah, let's see what Rice bought, and we can see if it can be aggressive or not. Yes, we can. He he doesn't have. He's trying to go for a Rod of Ages, or maybe a Banshee's Veil. But that's fine because I'm I'm way ahead of him right now. Even though he did get the shutdown bonus on me. As soon as I get my ignite, I'm gonna go for the kill. Enemy killing spree. 
Oh, that really sucks, though. Damn it. Double kill, what? Triple kill? No, double kill to the MF there. Don't make me beg. I really want to kill their guys here. But I'll just push the lane then. There we go. One, one on him. There we go, just doing damage there. No need to do more. And then I can pretty much dive in right now if I wanted to. Oh, damn. I forgot I don't have smart cast on my, e on my ultimate right now. <laughs> I almost got me killed there. Let me put that quickly. There we go. Much better. Okay, they're top, so I'm gonna do some damage to this. And steal the rates, actually. And yeah, she's fine. Stealing rates is quite easily easy. You just throw your your W and a couple of of E's, and there you go. You got you got the rates of the enemy. You can throw your Q and start landing your uh, adding your poison to all of the enemies. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Just let me get this quickly. Yeah, I'm on my way. Da, 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 da. I'm on my way. Ah, fell flash. I mean, fell arrow get this with that's fine my friend that's fine okay I got my blue buff I can spam this all day look at that <laughs> okay so far so good if Maokai ganks rice he's gonna be dead go I'm waiting for him to initiate no he didn't Decided not to, that's fine. No need to do anything crazy right now. What is going on here? Oh, oh, nice. I'm on my way. Oh, should I wait for multi? I don't got my ulti right now. Oh, I should have waited for a little bit longer for my ulti. Oh, get him, get him. Ah. Okay, we're gonna take down the mid. Let me go. Let me go back and get my needlessly large rod for even more AP. As you can see right now, I am two head, two levels ahead of Rise, and he decided to go for a tier instead of going for a little bit more defensive stats. I don't like that. He is kind of making a big mistake here. Yep. He doesn't have much tankiness right now. Well, he does have Mercury treads. But not not nearly enough. I'll, I'll, my combo still destroys him. Mit Mia. Okay. Okay, I lost my blue buff now, so I gotta be careful not to. Spellcraft. Oh, no, man. no man, you don't have enough damage. No man, not enough damage. You're dead. I'm on my way. No, no, no not, not, not that way, man. Oh, one more! An oh, nice. Good job there. No, not that, not that way. You found me, beast. Your team has destroyed a turret. Got him. Yeah, nice. You have slain an enemy. That passive saved him so many freaking times there. That was awesome. Oh, I, let's let's steal the blue, the blue buff. Yeah, I can steal it right now. They have no jungler, and I don't think Rai's going to be... Smart enough to come, or actually, if he comes out, can kill him as well. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Oh, look at that damage. Yep. Let's put down a ward and take the rates. Almost got enough for my death cap as well. I'll let uh, look at the farming a little bit. Should be way ahead of Rice. Tell Let's see, 93. Everything. Actually, not that much. Well, I have been getting those kills, so that's fine. No, oh, not enough mana to do anything there. Good thing Rice didn't turn back and start attacking me. That would have been very bad. Just trying to keep my passive up. Not gonna spam that much. Got fresh one. You get. 
Yeah, I just got the, I just got mine, so that's fine. Huh. I'll clear one more wave and I'll head head back now. I'm listening. What's going on here? Hey, he's fine. Oh, almost got him there. As you wish. Uh -huh. Okay. Taking the rates once again. Of course. There we go. Easy, easy, easy farm. Huh, I might go top and actually he's going. You can also do some awesome initiating with your ultimate if you're able to If you're able to land your ultimate with a flash ultimate, <laughs> and that that actually pretty much is a kill Tell on anyone. Everything. Oh, he was running away. Oh crap. I might be able to kill him actually. Never mind, not enough damage. <laughs> what a dumb. That was pretty dumb. Okay, I'm getting way too cocky right now. Um, I think I'll get a uh, of the ancients now. Care. Okay, uh, after the getting the revolver, I'll get a crystal scepter. The slow and your spammo um, abilities are awesome with it. Damn, that was so pretty, dumbass. Let's see here, two kills on him. The thing is, rice can become extremely powerful if left alone for a little bit. So As you wish. can't really let let him get any type of advantage. Get it with the with the ultimate. I don't know what he wants. Oh, yeah, Fiora. <laughs> that was pretty weird. You're no fun. You're no fun. Your team has destroyed. A Yay, go team! Go and team! No team. Killing spree. Good job. That ash. Look at my damage. Look at that. It landed two Qs on him. It's gonna have less than half HP. Did he flash? No, I was the one who flashed. Come in. Ooh, look at that HP. No HP. Oh, okay, okay. Go. Flash in. Flash in or something. Go, 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 go. No ulti. Flash in. Come on, fine, whatever. That was bad, man. You should have just gone in there. <sighs> fine. Surrender to me. They're waiting for me to make a mistake. Got him. Dead. There you go. Olive! Yes! Oh, I thought I had a knight on, but it's the MF passive. Oh man, <laughs> that's nuts. Watch listen, come here and kill me to death. Nope, I live. Yay. Okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. Okay, Cassiopeia is not really a a powerful champion for ganking, but oh, you miss. Oh, they both miss. <laughs> she missed her W, and he misses Q. She's not that powerful in, in ganking in the sense that she doesn't have any dashes or stuff like that, so it's pretty hard to to actually connect a good Oh, excellent job though. It's very hard for, for her Let me just get this kill soon. Double kill. Nice, good job there. Oh no you're dead! Damn. Uh, unless you have like a very very strong uh, allied that you're helping, for example, actually the Ash is a very good example of this. She can slow and stun enemies to, to initiate for you, and after she initiates, you can actually go in there and do your full combo, and that should be enough to take out most of your enemies. Remember, your burst is extremely powerful. 
And having that movement speed on your Q really allows you to stick to your targets and keep chasing. Almost got my ulti once again. Okay, I'm on my way. Let me just get this quickly. Of course. Okay. Yes, I've been getting fed, uh, fed with blue buffs, so that's awesome for me. Let's go get the dragon. Get the dragon, dragon, dragon. I can take this. I got my spell bam, so I can spam this all day. Look at that, and so much sustain as well. I'm listening. Oh, I can actually get HP right now if I wanted, or more AP. Huh. Plenty of gold. No, what's going on here? Oh, nice job. That Maka is just everywhere as well. He's done a very good job. Cassiopeia is extremely weak against champions that have uh, dashes and s silences or stuns, so she's actually very weak against assassins. LeBlanc is very powerful against her. And Talon, all Talon just destroys him. Uh, destroys her, actually. But she is quite powerful against most AP, AP carries. And if she has troubles against someone, she can just stay back and farm. So that's very, very awesome of her. Oh, nice slow there. So apparently we're just gonna be standing here until someone initiates. Oh, if if Skarner flashes in and ultis me, I'm pretty much done. So I gotta be on the back side of things. Oh, your W does give you vision when you... That's a great time for initiating. Yeah, it is. Perfect! Ulti! Oh, she ulted, he ulted me! But that's, I'm fine now. No! Oh, those flashes. I had a perfect ulti there. But I just got suppressed by this corner. That was awesome, regardless. Getting full this and some HP. That was completely worth it. Uh, worth it. Now we can get an easy turret, maybe even two. No! Oh! What? The projectile got destroyed when the turret died. That's awesome. <laughs> Let's see here. Yeah, we, we pretty much secured our dominance of the game right now. The only thing that could happen is they, if they make a move for Baron right now, but it's still not worth it for them. We can. Pretty much take him out. Listen, buying what the hell he has a Thornmail. Really? What a weird choice of items. Well, I guess against Fiora kinda works. Say please. Generally Listen can destroy Fiora, I guess uh, Fiora got a lot of help from the Malkai. So he has pretty much no magic resist right now. Look at that. Look at that. He's dead. Another one. <laughs> I'm just way too strong right now. Nothing they can do. Yay for added HP. Let's just get Baron. Oh, 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 she's right there. Go, go, go. Gotta be careful though if she ulties. We oh. Ah, oh, she she went the other way. That was gonna be awesome, but nope. That did not work. Let's just push down the mid or take take Baron. We can take Baron. Okay, okay, that's fine. Yeah, stay back, stay back, stay back. They know. Oh, that now they know we're doing Baron. So. Oh oh. We're gonna wait there for them here. Are we? Nope. No, the, the ward man. 
Uh, let me go go top and get that farm. We're not doing anything right now. Oh, a lot of enemies so I can recover my HPs. I'm not gonna spam that much anymore because I really need to get oh No, no <sighs> Really? Got it. Oh, you're dead. Oh, you're dead. Yep, you're dead. Awesome. Ooh, let me get the blue buff. You're gonna engage. Don't engage that. I don't think we can catch him. Nope. We just get this. There we go. Now we can push. No, no, no. <sighs> That's dumb. Never do that. It's not worth it. I think they flashed when she did her ulti or something. You found me. Da 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 Whoa, laggy, laggy, laggy. You're dead. And another one, please. Oh, I don't got my flash. Damn, and my flash, I needed it. Bad idea, Nunu. You're not gonna live, boy. Not gonna live. Ooh, I'm almost there. No, he's gonna live. No, not enough mana. That's fine. And I think we're done here. I think taking this, then we can push, push the other uh, turret. Oh, I got so much freaking gold. I'm gonna go get my crystal scepter, and then. I don't know. Don't be Maybe more AP. Oh, nice. Nice damage there. Oh, crap. Oh, that's a thank you. Thank you for that. That was nuts. Nuts, I tell ya. Okay, Crystal Scepter for some epic kiting. And you know what? I'm just gonna get a... I can sell this. And I'm gonna buy a Sonya's Horror Glass. For when the Skarner is about to, to grab me, I can go into that and I should cancel his ulti. If I'm quick enough, of course. He's building full armor. Look at that. Look at that. Full armor. Don't make me beg. He doesn't realize I'm the one doing the most damage. But that's fine by me. As you wish. Na, 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 na. That's fine by me. Na, 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 na. No! Oh, thank you. I want that money. Okay, take the bottom turret. Whoa, look at that. Nice arrow there. You're dead. So much slow on my part. And we actually have so much slow uh, in general. Look at that. Epic movement speed. Look at that. You're too pro. Nope, we got us on the boat. Okay, guys, so hope you liked that game. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and let me know what champions you want to see next, and I'll do the best I can to upload them. In better side, signing out.